Good morning guys, happy Vlogmas. I'm inserting the Vlogmas day number right here. I'm a little discombobulated with my Vlogmas organization, so that's something I'm gonna take care of today, but I'm also gonna vlog. It is 6.50 on Saturday, December 5th. Oh, it's the 15th, 10 days till Christmas, and I, if you can't already tell by my hair, just woke up, Will's out of town, and I'm doing some fun stuff, so we're just gonna get the day started. Since I got home from Chicago, I've been sneezing nonstop, so, whoo, focus. It's fucking ugly. I've been feeling like I'm fighting off like a sickness, and I've just like, it's all on my nose. Just pray for me. About to go to the gym because I have a vet appointment for me at 10 o'clock. It's just her annual checkup. I'm taking her home with me for Christmas, so I just need to make sure all of her papers are up to date. She's due this month. So I'm gonna go to the Golds that I don't normally go to because they open at seven, and the one I go to opens at eight, and it's just not enough time. Drinking my pre-workout, and take the dogs out, and then go. I feel like I'm always wishing for it to be colder here, and then whenever it's cold, I'm like, no. It's like my fingers are cold. It's probably like 40. I'm so weak. Something I found out, Aquaphor, amazing for chapped lips. I have this weird habit of needing like chapstick whenever I go to the gym. And this is what I usually use. I found this out actually when I, I bought this when I got my tattoo. Cause it's like, it's actually not meant for lips. It's like for dry cracked or irritated skin. You never think to put it on your lips. So I had some from when I got my tattoo, and then when I got my lips done the second time, the lady handed me little packets of Aquaphor, and she was like, use this, it's like the best chapstick ever, and I was like, oh, actually I have some, you can keep that. But yeah, ever since, Aquaphor on your lips, would definitely recommend. I'm out of breath, because I took pre-workout, so that means I need to go. <laughs> I just got home from the gym. It was a pretty good workout actually. I feel pretty dead. So I'm gonna go eat. I have about an hour until I have to get Mika to the vet. I think I'm gonna walk over there. It's like just on the street. So you get jump on it, not showering. <laughs> Judge me, don't care. Still have another workout to hit later. So see you guys in a minute. Mika, Mika. Everybody at the vet calls Mika Micah, and I spell it M-I-K-A, so I guess I could see it, but I just never say anything, and it bugs me. <laughs> Alright, just got home from taking Mika to the vet. I have to go to the track to film the video that you guys saw yesterday, so I don't really want to do the workout, but leave it to Vlogmas to keep me busy on a Saturday doing things I don't want to do, but I did it for you guys. I just got finished up with the track workout that I was doing. Wiped me out. If you guys haven't seen the video, I'm gonna link it below. It was yesterday's Vlogmas video. So now I'm headed over. There's a new coffee place that opened up. I didn't know it was open until I saw people coming out yesterday. Just down the street, it's called Austin Java. So I'm gonna go check it out. I'm just get a small coffee. I don't need a whole lot of caffeine right now. Oh my God, it's so beautiful outside. I was just laying on the track. So warm in the sun, the track's warm, like, it was good. I feel like I just ran a lot, and I did. So apparently, there's another Austin Java in Austin. Didn't know that. Thought this was like a new exclusive place, wrong. It was also like a restaurant, so it was super like, the name Austin Java, I'm like, oh, it's a coffee shop. I'm just gonna walk in, like Starbucks, order, chill. No, it's a restaurant. Let's see how the coffee is. I got an Ameri my usual, Americano with soy milk and stevia. It's hot, but it's good. Ooh, that's actually really good. Yeah, I dig that. I'm going home. I forgot to show you guys what I was having for lunch. I'm gonna insert a photo right here. Now I'm showered, I'm going to edit a YouTube video, and then, I haven't told you guys this yet, but I'm very excited, I have a massage at 4.45, and I can't wait. It's 2.15 right now. Just chillin'. 
I look like I just woke up. I just got done my massage. So, as the day's gone on, I've gotten progressively more congested. The peak of it was at my massage while I was laying face down on the table for an hour. <sighs> the number three most embarrassing moment of my life just happened. If you're like an OG Snapchat friend, you already heard this, but this is for the rest of the world because this is just really funny and I need to do this quickly because my camera's gonna die. So, I'm laying on the table, feeling a little congested. It's fine. Then I feel my nose start to get like a little drippy. I'm like, okay, I can handle it. Look down like five minutes later and there's like a four inch like snot drip hanging from my nose and I'm like, oh my God, what am I gonna do? <laughs> I don't know what to do. So it starts dripping on the floor and I'm like, I don't know what to do. So eventually she goes, and I'm like, yes, please. I mean, like, did she see this not drip? Did she see this not hanging? I don't know. And I just felt like mortified, mortified. Now my sinuses are super swollen because I was laying face down for like an hour. I'm extremely stuffy and like worse than I was beforehand. Not to mention, I couldn't even relax during the freaking massage because apparently I'm very tight. She was just going to work on me and it hurt but also I was like concerned about this whole snot thing so I was like not the most relaxing thing in the world however I feel pretty good now but but she said I guess she was like coming towards the end she was doing my traps my traps must be bad because she did a lot of work on them she said and you asked me if you were tight like, you know when you like rub a muscle and it like slips out from underneath that's what happened and I was like oh is that like slipping me she's like yeah basically the muscle doesn't want me to try to like rub it out I was like oh okay and she said, Yeah, I just need to drink more water and stretch more. And I was like, I drink a gallon and a half of water a day. And she goes, Oh, well, you're just a mess then. Will I be coming back to you? Probably not. Mostly just because of the snot. <laughs> not because of what you said. <laughs> but that's my massage story. It's 7 o'clock now. I'm going to make some food and just chill out. Try to figure out how to de detox my sinuses. And then, yeah, I'll catch up with you guys later. Good morning, guys. It's the next day, and I am very bad at closing out vlogs. After my massage last night, I had, like, frozen fruit and a protein shake and pretzels for dinner. I just, like, wasn't that hungry and was feeling kind of lazy. And then I put on a movie and fell asleep, like, 30 minutes into it. I woke up on the couch at, like, midnight, and I was like, oh, my God, what year is it? One of those kind of sleeps. And then I just went to bed. So super exciting day in the life of me. Um, oh, yesterday was a pretty good day. So thank you guys very much for watching. More vlogmas to come. We still got a few days left. I appreciate you watching this video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you tomorrow.